Hello miners, Rusty coming at you. Today we're going to take a look at another case trapper. This is the case, we're going to call it Burnt Bone Caribbean Blue. want to say that's what it is. Trapper with a bullet shield. Otherwise known as the Sea Dragon. Now this knife is a Smoky Mountain Knife Works exclusive. And I was lucky to get on on these. Right now they are sold out. I don't know if they're awaiting a back order. But this and the lizard skin both utilize what's known as this burnt bone. I'm not sure how they do it. If they actually take a flame to it or stick it in a toaster. But I really do believe it is burnt. Uh, my example has good transitions. Good liners and springs. Well, I'm satisfied with the blade centering. This could be touched over, but it's no blade rub. A little bit dissatisfied with the coloring, although it looks pretty decent under the camera here. Almost equate it sometimes to how, you know, they get those big juicy pictures of burgers at the fast food restaurants. And then you get a soggy one <laughs> when they serve it to you. These things look gorgeous. And this was over dyed right in this area. Under dyed, under burned up here in my opinion. And this one is just too, maybe there's this white yellowy streaks. Now I may try to flame that, take a flame to it. But let's go here. These are in stainless steel. Good action, it's about the same as the rest of my case trappers. I believe that's a blade etching. We're in the true sharp stainless steel. And so that's gonna be just your standard case full size trapper. I do have a mini one of these. And so if you like to look at that check it out the coloring on it turned out much better but this is pretty cool looks like waves and this is a uh, ocean color definitely ocean color sorry guys kind of rambling probably an easy right at a five with a good snap with that spade blade I should mention uh, both the edges have slight burr. Now this blade will, should not rust as easily. Uh, let's go back to this action. Good snap. Right about a five-ish. Maybe just a touch stronger than the other one. Oh, and the clip point. Uh, what are we going to do here today, Rusty? Well, I'm going to show you another case knife I got, which is new. And this one is almost essential if you're a case collector. This is the yellow Delrin. And Randy, if you're watching this, I know you don't like the yellow Delrin. Uh, but, tremendous as far as probably numbers sold, I would say more yellow delrin case trappers have been sold than any other case knife and that's really something and uh, this one would be in carbon steel let's see if we can see that i think we need to get maybe forgive me if i can't find it there we are CS. Now that used to be marked CV for chrome vanadium. Well, let's go. Okay. Man, the action. That's one thing about case is uh, even though I don't think they can get their side to side, you know, their knives range so much, their, their action on their trappers uh, is really pretty spot on. So, I want to do a short video on my case Delrin trappers. 
if you guys want to check that one out. Um, but these, just a comparison, I kind of got the traditional and I got the latest. This is crazy, in my opinion. I've only been following Case for about a year. Uh, in my opinion, this is a crazy one. Like this in terms of something different. Now, Case has, Case has done some crazies over the year and they got saw cut care caribbean bone and stuff like that but anyways we'll go ahead and wrap this up thanks guys and every time i <laughs> put the uh i say thanks guys and put my knife down i wonder why do i have that knife out uh this is a rough rider this is what the newest amber bone uh in my opinion this would be their dark amber and they went really heavy on this. I think they changed the color a lot like their cold steel. They're doing the cold steel trap, I'm almost sure. But this, in terms of Rough Rider, is a bad die job. And it still, in my opinion, beats this. So that's one thing. However, between the two, uh, Case has got it going on. Uh, they they put a ring on here they do a great job of jigging they do a great job putting their shields in and uh yeah very and they dude 15 bucks or i think i got that for like 12. so just want to throw that out there thanks guys